Hi guys, this is Saurabh. In this video, we will learn how we can use Cloud DV in MIT App Inventor. Okay, so let's create one project here. Let's start new project, and that's my project name is Cloud DV Data. Okay, so what is Cloud DV? Cloud DV is a component, non-visible component, where we can store our data in internet. Okay, it means whenever you store your data in one app and you can retrieve this data in another mobile phone using your app okay so first let's store the data how we can store the data and how we can retrieve the data using cloud tv so first we need to drag and drop cloud tv okay and the left side you will find a storage option and drag and drop this cloud tv first thing that one is non visible component okay now click on user interface and I'm going to drag and drop here two text box. First one is I'm going to store tag and that one is for second one is for value. So I'm going to make this one with this fill parent and that one is also fill parent. Simply like this. Okay. Now I'm going to change this background color of my screen is black. Fine. So I have two things. I have two text box. First one is hint text is tag okay and that one is value in the second okay now i have to use one button here to save this data okay and i'm to make this one is also fill parent and rename this button to text is save data like this okay now you can change this button background color also fine now let's create one drag and drop one element here you can see list view right so this is the list view where we will display our tags of cloud dv okay and whenever someone click on any tags of this list then we will display the data of or value of that one particular tag okay so that's the list view and let me just create one more button to retrieve the data okay so i'm to make this one i'm just here get data like this button and i'm to make this one fill parent and change this background color also pink and make it font bold like this fine now go to the uh, block button wait i want to display the value in notifier okay i'm sorry i'm going to drag and drop this notifier here and now go to the block section so whenever someone click on this button one okay so we have to save the data in cloud db so click on cloud db and here you can see the store value cloud db dot store value just drag and drop this and here you can see there's two options first one is tag and second one is value to store it means in this tag which value you want to store so i'm going to store which one tag this one text box one dot text this one and make it copy and paste and which value you have to store is text box two dot text that one is my value okay so now we have done the storing part we have stored the tag and we have stored the value now now we have to fetch the value so whenever someone click on this button two it means this one then we will fetch all tags of this database okay from this uh, method you can see call cloud db dot get tag list okay it means we are fetching all tags from that cloud db okay now whenever we call this so automatically call this cloud db function you can see the get tag list okay when it means when cloud db dot tag list then okay then what we will do we will set all these value all these value in the set list view dot element so we have to set all these value in list it means list view dot element you can see set element this one sorry 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 this one set list view one dot element this one and we will fetch cat value here like this right now we have 
what we have done we are fetching the all tags from cloud db and set all these tags value in the list view elements okay now whenever someone select the any tags from this list then we will uh, we will display using notifier one particular value of that tag so whenever you can see the when list v1 dot after picking then we will call here call dot get value here you can see the get value cloud db dot get value and which tag we have to select so it means list view dot selection here you can see the selection option this one list view dot selection and value if not there then we will display anything like value not found something like that you can just and you can uh, display your null like this okay now wherever we get the value then this block will automatically call which one when cloud db dot caught value this one okay now for that click on this notifier and can see the message so message this one in the message we will display the value okay value this one and in the title what we will do in the title we will uh, say like suppose password uh, suppose this is the password then we will display the, this password and the button is okay something okay then this one okay right so let me run this app and how this app work now we can see that's my app here okay now you can see that one is tag okay so let me just put tag one and the value is something value uh, value one okay and then click on save data fine now let me just fetch the data using this button get data and you can see tag one okay now let me save another value tag two value two and save this data also let me put three and three you can store any tag and any value and now click on get that get data and you can see tag one tag two and tag three we are not able to see the value here okay of this tag one or tag two so let me click on tag two button and you can see the tag two value is value two right click on okay right so that's the use of cloud db where you can fetch the data where you can store the data and you can fetch all tags you can fetch all value you can do a lot of things with this cloud DB. There are a lot of, lot of apps you can create with this cloud DB. You can store some score, high score. There are a lot of things you can do with this. Okay. So let me know if you have some, still some doubt in cloud DB. I will definitely try to solve your problem. Okay. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe my channel, like this video and share this video. Please, please subscribe this channel, please. Okay. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Have a nice day. Be safe.